Hello friends from Valorosa Gallery here in Tyler, Texas. Today we're going to have an art demo and an art lesson painting a desert landscape with, with lots of bright, vibrant colors and practicing our cactus shapes and a moon in the sky, uh, practicing using lots of texture, building up layers of color, and uh, practicing your highlights, your shadows, and just making things pop and sparkle. So keep painting. Okay, this is about uh, the end of the beginning of this painting. I have color blocked out my shapes with a basic, kind of a base color on top of my underpainting. I do love to start my paintings with a bright underpainting. And this one started out with gold and uh, will be a great desert under color. And so we're blocking out shapes of my cactus shapes and I've kind of, when you're doing oil especially, I'm painting my dark colors around my shapes because your dark colors can really muddy up your uh, shapes and, uh, and your other things that you're going to place on top of your painting. So when you're careful doing um, an oil painting, your colors kind of need to bump up against, to, against each other side by side. I normally I paint, I love to paint wet into wet, and this is painting wet into wet, but I'm being careful to, uh, when I overlap colors, that they can mix together. Like I had a little blue on here, but it made a nice shadowy gray color, and I am kind of blending, overlapping the um, my red ochre and yellow ochre and red and, um, yellow and orange into this desert landscape grassy area around my cactus. So this is a great way I kind of like layer my colors which create new colors too. And so I'm just going to scrub this in, kind of scrub this in, and this is like my second and third layer right here. It's going to have lots of layers. And then I'm going to go back and layer in my cactus all over again with lots of different colors, a light and medium and a dark green, light, medium and dark yellow and golden colors across the bottom. And then I'll come back in and do my moon. My sky has a light and a medium and a dark blue color for kind of a night sky. And I've got a touch of black in here, but mostly it's three shades of different, just pure blue, just putting on lots of pure blue. And then just kind of my horizon is going to be just different lighter shades of blue. Trying to give it a nice contrast. This is gonna be a brighter painting, not too neutral, but just lots of good contrast. Keep your eye moving around. I'm repeating my colors across the canvas as I go. So your eye will travel around. Make sure it has a good design and a good balance of shapes as you're working. Okay, keep painting. Okay. Getting close to the very end, this is the finishing details of uh, my desert landscape. I like to use a lot of metallics and reflecting the moon into your cactus at night. And so I've got a lot of silver and gold into my cactus. And I'll take kind of a very sharp metal stick that's an old paintbrush, and you can go in and Really give your cactus some more details if you want to give it its thorns. Here is its little thorny cactus spikes coming out. This is a great way to do that. 
to kind of um, add some detail. See, that's kind of fun. You can just see it, I'm painting it out and in, out and into uh, the background. And so, and twist and drag, you can kind of twist it, twist, twist and drag. This is a great tool to outline things with too. So if I wanted to come in and define more of my cactus lines, I can do this and drag in and out, in and out your paint back and forth back and forth into your piece like this. This is really fun to do. I like to go in and add a lot of purple. Purple is a great shadow color, a lot of lavender, turquoise. So go in and just play with your shapes. Go back in and add a great thing to outline. Outline your cactuses here and play. Just play with it some more. And your grasses, here's some desert grasses. Add some of that and uh, so and some more of our prickly, of our prickly pears. We have some prickly pear here, and this is a saguro, and this is a golden like barrel plant. So I'm learning my cactus. Golden barrel are um, queens of the night, and uh, and I love to put a little man in the moon. This is kind of my little man in the moon here, and so he's kind of got a little bit of a face here. It's hard to tell, but which is just hidden. One of my hidden images. I love to hide things in into my little paintings. So he is in here, just hiding, you see. Okay, and now I'm just adding my little final details, just finishing up, finishing up. I'm gonna go in and add, like, add some stars. See, look, twist and drag. Look at that, add some little stars to your background too. Don't forget to do that. Just fun little details, fun little details. And this oil paint is wonderful because you can move it around. It doesn't dry as fast as acrylic, so you can really play with your images. So, and I can even pick up some white and like just dot it on there too. Dot it on there with my tool. This is like my little tool. And try to do groups of stars. Normally I like to splatter with a fan brush. I do lots of splattering with spam. And so this is another technique too. You can practice. Just practice, practice, practice. And keep layering colors. Layer your shadows. Here's a highlight and a shadow. Highlight and a shadow. We've got a shadow here and a highlight. Shadow, highlight. So you just keep, keep practicing. And happy cactus to you.